Wondering how to copy and paste in Procreate? My name is Dee and I'm excited to show you the various ways you can copy and paste in Procreate. Whether you're looking to duplicate elements or layers or if you want to work on multiple versions of your artwork, Procreate's copy and paste feature is incredibly helpful. Method 1. How to copy and paste a whole layer. The first method I'm going to show you today is how to copy and paste a whole layer. To do this, you need to make sure that the things you want to copy are on a separate layer. So to do this, select your layers icon. This opens up your layers and what is on each layer. Select the layer you want to duplicate and swipe to the left. Then select duplicate and your layer is immediately duplicated. If you've only got one element on that layer, that's what will be duplicated. The second way you can copy and paste in Procreate is by using the selection tool. This is located amongst the editing tools in the top left hand corner of your screen. There are four options you can use when using the selection tool. These include automatic, freehand, rectangle, and ellipse. I most often use the freehand selection tool because I find it gives me more control over exactly what it is I want to copy and paste. So what you're going to do is select your freehand tool, outline the element you want to copy, and then select copy and paste. You will see that your selected object has been now pasted onto a completely new layer which is really helpful in terms of constructive digital editing. The third method is arguably the fastest way to copy and paste in Procreate. This is by using a gesture shortcut called the three finger swipe. Literally to use this gesture, you're going to take three fingers, your forefinger, middle finger and ring finger. Make sure that you are on the layer that you want to copy. So I'm going to use that. You take your three fingers, you swipe down, you click copy in the menu, you then swipe down again, oops, swipe down again, and you select paste. And you'll see that your copied object is now pasted on its own layer once again. And you can change that, move it around, edit it as you will. To make sure the three finger gesture shortcut is enabled, go to Actions, Prefs, Gesture Controls, Copy and Paste, and select the three finger swipe down. Mine is already selected. Sometimes you want to copy and paste an element or layer to a completely new canvas, and this is where Method 4 comes in. Make sure to have everything you want to copy visible on your screen. Then go to the wrench icon, select Add, and select Copy Canvas. This will copy everything on your screen that is visible on your canvas. Then go to Gallery, select New Canvas. I'm just positioning mine. And then select the wrench tool again and click Paste. And this will paste the object that you copied. However, it will be flat, it will be rasterized. Um, it will not be in layers, so you cannot edit it uh, as you did in the previous document. The other thing that you can do is copy just the selected layer. So if you have a look, I've selected the purple lemon slice. I'm then going to my wrench tool. I say copy on its own. I go back to my document and I select paste and it pastes that single element from the layer that I had selected in the previous artwork. This method is really useful when you want to work on different versions of the same artwork or if you want to copy elements to a new project. Now that you know how to copy and paste in Procreate, you can streamline and speed up your digital art workflow. 
If you found this video helpful, please hit the subscribe button now and watch this next video on my top Procreate color palettes and where you can download them for free. Thanks for watching.